really none truer The laws can't stop me and the nobles can't block me I got all the power and I crave it by the hour Absolutism at its core, it's power forevermore I get it all the time, I'm just one of a kind Rule a nation by my design, it's monarchy defined I can tax who I want and I can do it nonchalant God put me here, it's your job to adhere My nation can be large, but believe it, I'm in charge As the Sun King once said in the words you probably read There ain't no debate I am the state, yes I got a lot on my plate, but hey it's divine right, my fate. My religion's gotta be yours, and that's just one of my cores, which makes it part of your chores. You can't diss me in this, if you do it'll be the freedom that you miss. I'll throw you in prison, never to escape my abyss. I hope you get it by now, nothing happens unless I allow. So go ahead and just bow, there ain't no way, no how, that you'll escape my rule. I'm just that cool, and it don't matter even if I'm cruel. Talking about absolutism here. I'm in charge, not restricted by any laws. Come on now, you remember. I'm an absolute ruler and there's really none truer. The laws can't stop me and the nobles can't block me. I got all the power and I crave it by the hour. Absolutism at its core, power forevermore. We got Spain. France, England, and Russia. And don't forget about that newer Prussia, who at the time, man, they could really crush ya. Leave you hurt in days, you can say that they concussed ya. They all had rulers over their nation, and it took place for years, a long duration. And successors to the throne, man, they were by blood relation. But they were complications. Catholics and Protestants fought, it led to much devastation. This is big and important, call it an exclamation. It ain't no annotation, it's the main event. You know what it is. It's the foundation. Do you need an illustration for this little education? I'll give it to you quick. Just look at Queen Elizabeth and Charles V. Both monarchs in their own right, ruling with all power and all might. Much different from the government we have today, where there's laws that restrict everybody. There's balance of powers, but not back then. Let's sing it. I'm an absolute ruler and there's really none truer The laws can't stop me and the nobles can't block me I got all the power and I crave it by the hour Absolutism at its core, it's power forevermore well, Let's take a pause for a second And let me give you some information about this age of absolutism This replaced the old system of feudalism Where you had more localized governments It wasn't widespread, it wasn't spread over throughout all of Europe more like towns and regions but now in absolutism you have much bigger areas that are in need of control and so you have centralized governments you have competitions between all those different lands the dominant players being England France Prussia Austria and Russia and they all have religious divisions you see Protestants were from England or Prussia whereas Catholics they were from France and Austria and Eastern Orthodox Christians, they were from Russia. And this is all in the 15th, 16th, and 17th century. Let's get I'm it. I'm an absolute ruler and there's really none truer. The laws can't stop me and the nobles can't block me. I got all the power and I crave it by the hour. Absolutism at its core, it's power forevermore. Don't forget some key terms on your way out. Big one, divine right of kings. Kings ruled by God. What they say goes.